Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I got a phone call at 9. My flight was at 12.55, and it got delayed a little bit, so. <laughs> um, but then just came in and worked out. And yeah. How, um, what have you, have you been sort of, you know, staying sharp in the whole snapping thing? What was your workout with? stuff like before and, and how ready do you feel to kind of step in here and be you know? um, I, I feel I feel very ready and just uh, I, I was uh, with the Ravens during preseason so mm -hmm. they kind of kept me sharp and I kind of learned the ways of the league a little bit yeah. and uh, I am just it's only been a week off but I've been snapping and sticking to my regiment and, and uh, I'm just ready to come in here and help the team out yeah when you, um, I mean, when when you are sort of sitting at home, kind of hoping for, waiting for a call, how closely do you pay attention to the league? And when you see something happen, like DePaulo getting injured, I mean, do you anticipate potentially getting a call? Yeah, actually, uh, I was watching the game and saw him get hurt, and I was actually like, well, I should probably get to bed. I might have a long day. <laughs> as as much as I hate to see someone else get hurt, but. It's the it's the nature of the league. How much did uh, the Ravens have you snap in camp, or like or in preseason? That kind of thing? Um, I I snapped in all five of their preseason games. Okay, so I was. So yes, we came out for like a tryout. There's a bunch a bunch of guys here. How'd that go? How'd that go? Um, it went well apparently. Yeah. <laughs> so well, how many guys were there? Yeah, was it um, I, th I think there were about three or four. I'm not 100 percent sure about that. I got in after everyone because my flight got delayed. Okay. So it was just just me by the time I got here. You were the last one. Yep. And was are you nervous that kind of thing or is it not kind of old um, old hat by now or? It's it's kind of is what it is by now. Just just used to used to snap and went through all preseason and just kind of know know the pressures that are expected of it and know how to handle them. So. Have you gone through all the various snapping camps and all these things that they have now? Um, yeah, I was mo mostly with Coach Zahner and I did a Coles camp back in high school, but but yeah, I haven't, I wasn't too, cra or too crazy in depth with them, but I, I definitely did work with them. Okay. So it just kind of seems like there's almost kind of a brotherhood among snappers yeah. in this league. Do you have, know any of them or have you met many guys? That yeah, definitely. I'm actually, I'm friends with uh, Rick Lovato over, over with the Eagles and I met him at one of Coach Zahner's camps. And, mm -hmm. and then I'm also in a group chat with some other guys and uh, Lucas Gravel, who just got signed to the Miami Miami's practice squad. And we're all just kind of pulling for each other and as we're going through all this. So. So when, when Andrew had, to, had his bad break, or is that the kind of thing that the, you guys take notice of? I mean, you don't want to, I understand. But yeah. You guys yeah. on your group chats. Is a yeah, kind of yeah, we're, we're, it's, we're it's all a bad break here. Yeah, we're all aware of what's going on all, on every team every year. So, mm -hmm. or every week, I should say, not every year. So but who, um, I'm sorry, who's in the group? It's like kickers or what? I mean, it's, uh, it, or it's, it's mostly it's just snappers. The guys we're not in the league, or guys are both, or um, guy, guys in the league guys trying to break into the league and just some guys that we met over over the years and like to stay in touch with. How, how large is the group? Um, it's about five or six guys. Oh, cool. so. What were you doing when you got the call and, and what did you think when you, you think um, the Raiders wanted you? So, so during the night I woke up about every two hours and was checking my phone because it's a little bit of a trip for me to the airport and I didn't want to end up missing a flight but it was just eating breakfast actually just kind of getting ready for the day and then Got the phone call from my agent saying I'm coming out here for a workout. So, so you knew, obviously, you, you had an inkling that you were going to get an opportunity here in Oakland. What do you think about playing for the Raiders and John Gruden of all coaches? Yeah, I mean, I always loved watching John Gruden's and uh, football camps and everything, and I think he seems like a great personality. And I haven't had the pleasure of meeting him quite yet, but, <laughs> but uh, I'm I'm excited to be out here and excited to help the team out.